Let's uh, move right along and talk to uh, a gentleman who is uh, into uh, that particular lineup of, of vehicles that uh, everybody has to have at some point along the line if you're in a building project or you're digging a trench or whatever that is, and that would be F-Series ex excavators, and I want to introduce you to Ken Gray, one of the fine folks at Caterpillar. Good to see you, sir. How are you doing? Fantastic. And how's your booth been? <laughs> Standing room only. It's really? Been, it's been fantastic. Ready to sell tickets? <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, yeah, yeah, well, yeah, I don't want to scare people away. It's been, it's been great fun and, and a lot of optimism from uh, from everyone walking through. It's just, it's really been great. It's been a while since we've had the kind of, that sense of optimism yeah. uh, kind of pervasive across the crowd and uh, it's, it's been, been really a lot of fun. Great. Well, tell us about the F-Series excavators. What's new to the lineup this year or What's new in the technology field, and what's been applied to the machines? Well, we've got a, we've got a lot of things going on, and, and we've got the big we've got one of our big ones here. We've got a 390F here, and uh, so that's a tier four. It's a, it's our tier four final machine, and uh, the other I think the cool thing that we did is we brought some of the hybrid excavator technology up into into that machine. We took the IMV. The independent metering valves of the ACS main valve that's in the that's in the 336 sure. EH and put that in uh, in the 390F and uh, it'll outrun the machine it replaced and it'll use a lot less fuel than the machine it replaced. Well, that's so. got to be quite an engineering stunt to pull off something of that capability to put it into the mix. Well, I'm the guy that gets I get to take the credit for all the great work that the team does. That's right. a, I'm fond of saying all the time, but. Um, independent metering valves just they allow us to independently control every function on the machine and and uh, what mother nature did for us with a typical main, single stem main valve IMVs just do much more efficiently and uh, the team's done an excellent job we also have the uh, the tier 4 final version of our of our hybrid machine the 336F is is here uh, uh, the 336FH is here and uh, and we've got that cool X-ray display uh, on that unit, so yes. you can see how the how that. I've seen how that, that over works. at your booth. That's uh, really something. That's a lot of fun. That's uh, that's been that's been one of the areas that's t tough to find a place to stand. Yeah, yeah, uh, exactly. And we have a three we have a three twenty three. We have a lot of excavators here. They're they're cat grade control equipped. So, you know, I think one of the one of the messages from this show is we're trying to apply appropriate technology to reduce our customers' cost. And uh, not only can you, you know, we've been so focused as an industry on improving the performance and the efficiency of the machine, and now we're getting up above that. We're improving the performance of the job site, and the next level is going to be improving, helping our customers improve the performance of their overall business using appropriate technology. Okay, what, what, what's new as far as the operator comfort and the, and the controls, of, uh, has that been adopted? Some yeah, new, we've, uh, we've, we've taken the E-Series cab that everyone likes right. so much up through the big machines. So, so we've really just standardized across the line now to the same look and feel when you sit in the cab, something our customers have been asking us to do for, for quite a while. Well, it's great. You know, a company like yours that sits back and listens to the customers, the dealers, and that whole pipeline of information that's forthcoming that you could take and use that information and actually adopt it into equipment operations. And I had I had a dealer principal tell me recently, probably reminding me of how I need to behave. <laughs> he said he thought the most important characteristic of a leader was was humility. And he said because he said without it you cannot listen to your customer. That's and I exactly thought it was the right. greatest advice, a great great reminder. But uh, we're working very hard to listen to what our customers are telling us and, and responding to it. And uh, and we've gotten some very honest feedback from the from the people that have, that have visited the booth this week this week at uh, Con Expo as well. This has been really really interesting to get. Well, I want to thank you for stopping by. It's a real pleasure, and it, it, it's a happy experience for me to have Cat as a sponsor on the Construction News Tracker, and we just have a great relationship. And well, I want to thank you again we, for we, taking we, time out of a busy day here at the show. We listen to you all the time. It's oh uh, sure it's, you it's, do. It, we do. It's, 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 seriously, it's an honor to be sitting here. Oh, you told okay. me. Before before we came on that some people don't like doing it. I just cannot imagine that. <laughs> great fun for me, a some real treat. people don't. A real treat for me. Very Thank good. you very, very Thanks. much. Thanks, Ken Gray, representing the uh, F-Series Excavators for Caterpillar, and uh, it's it's fun. I, I enjoy these times at the show and Thanks, meeting sir. all these fellas, these product people, and uh, everybody else associated. It doesn't matter who the company is, but our particular association with Caterpillar is pretty positive.